and me reacting to it kahit na well wala naman talagang nandiyan <laughs> I'm going to show you how you can make that <laughs> I'm gonna show you how you can make text appear so you can create better graphics for your videos in After Effects. And we're starting right now. Game! So when you're able to master this effect of making text appear in After Effects, your videos could look so much better because these words or text that appear in your videos could supplement whatever it is you're trying to say and make it and give it more emphasis. Or it can also be used to create wonderful OBB videos or animation explainer videos because this effect is basically animating the position of the text and then pre-composing it and then masking just a certain area so that only that area will be seen when the text moves within the composition. So as you can see, I've already created this hello appearing dito sa upper left part ko and me reacting to it kahit na, well, wala naman talagang nandyan. <laughs> So to do this, you start of course by making a text layer and typing in your text. Right now my text is hello. And then go to the properties of the text. And then under the properties, you will see animate. Click the little arrow beside the word animate and click position. So pag na-click mo na yung position, madadagdagan ng property yung text layer mo which is animator. And under animator, you will see Position. So what you'll do is just basically change the position from where you want it to start. So in this case, we want it to start at the far left. No? Kasi it's gonna fly in, diba? So the start, yung start is nasa left siya. And then after that, you, you click the drop down arrow of the range selector. And then you basically keyframe the start of the uh, range selector. So you skip uh, 30 frames. So you hold command shift right, command shift right, and then you make the start 100%. So it goes to the ending position, which is the original position. So as you can see, we can see the word hello animating in. Pero character per character per lang siya, isa isa. So kasama yung excl exclamation point. So if you want the word hello mismo or the entire line to move in by itself, na hindi siya isa isa, you go to the advanced option and then click the drop down menu and then you go to the based on settings and then you change it from characters to words or lines i want the whole line to animate in so i'm gonna change it to lines and as you can see the entire word na pumapasok siya in one go na hello hello <laughs> and to make it more fluid I, I usually easy ease both the keyframes so you just select both keyframes and click function f9 or f9 for windows and then to make it more fluid, mas fluid pa, go to the graph editor and then you click the right keyframe and then you just pull the handle to the left, to the far left until hindi mo na siya mahila. And then as you can see, mas fluid na yung um, pagpasok ng hello. So sobrang bilis and then magde-decelerate siya. Wow! Decelerate! Magde-decelerate siya towards the end. And then if you want to make it more realistic pa, you can turn on the motion blur for the layer. So to turn on the motion blur, click on this box right here. And of course, you have to turn on the motion blur for the entire composition. You have to click this. So as you can see, meron na siyang konting motion blur kasi ang bilis niya sa start, di ba? Pag mabilis ka gumalaw, um, nag-motion blur naturally kapag sa screen, di ba? Or sa camera, parang see the flash. So that's what the motion blur is for, to make it more look realistic and natural. And then lastly, you pre-compose the layer so to pre-compose it, you hold Command-Shift-C and then you have to make sure to move all the attributes into the composition. So I'll rename it to Hello. And then what this does is it places all of the layers inside of a new composition. That's why it's called Precomp, wherein all of the effects are happening inside. And what we'll do now is create a mask uh, from the pre-comp that we made so we'll only see a certain part of this pre-composition. So you click on the shape layer or the shape tool so you can create a mask and you just draw, draw the shape of the mask that you want. So right now, wala pang nakikita kasi hindi pa nag animate But when you click space, Ayun. So yung nakikita mo na lang is within the rectangular box that you created. So that's what masks do. So it tells the software to only pay attention to that certain shape that you created. 
from your compositions and layers. And if you want to learn more about masks in After Effects, in the face masks, click on this playlist right here.